The local family is searching for answers as police investigate the shooting of their loved one. Tyvon Marco Henderson was gunned down in their West Garfield Park neighborhood. CBS 2 Suzanne Lemonyo has the story. Tyvon Marco Henderson's loved ones say he was committed to expressing himself and living life to the fullest. Everybody that was around him just loved him. He always had a smile. He greeted you with a smile. And he was just a joy. Let me tell you Henderson's family says he was a drag performer known as Leah Marie, a singer and social media content creator. His aunt says Henderson auditioned several times for the show RuPaul's Drag Race and was part of Chicago's LGBTQ community. He was definitely a rising star and he was amazing with what he does and he worked really hard. Henderson had just left his job at Walmart and got home around 1130 Wednesday night on the 4000 block of West Wilcox in the West Garfield Park neighborhood. He went to his car a few minutes after 1 a.m. on Thursday. His family thinks Henderson forgot a cell phone in his Honda. That's when the bullets started flying and started coming through my gate and it killed my son. At least 17 bullets went through this privacy gate. A bullet left a gaping hole in the hood of this car that was also in the parking lot. This dark colored SUV was caught on a nearby camera in the alley just before the shots were fired. Right after that dark colored SUV went east right here down this alley, people in the community heard at least 20 shots ring out. Tyvon was shot seven times. The Virginia Union University graduates family says they just want answers. Did the person in the SUV see anything? Was the vehicle involved in some way? Was a car looking for someone else and maybe it was mistaken identity. We just want the truth. We just want to know what happened. We just want anyone who knows anything to say something. Henderson is with his grandmother in this photo. She died last October from COVID-19. The family is still dealing with her funeral expenses. His brother set up this GoFundMe page to help pay for Henderson's funeral. It could have been any other way except gun violence. Like, I shouldn't, I can't wrap my brain around it. I just can't. Suzanne Lemonyo, CBS 2 News.